Gentlemen, Shaber 1000 here. Today I want to talk a little bit about the new uh, terms, YouTube terms. I'm just now finding out about it because I just got the email today, but apparently people's known about it for months. Let's get into this. Okay guys, so in a nutshell, YouTube's going to start um, running ads on non-monetized channels. I'll show you the uh, email I got today, which I don't know why it's so late for me, but a lot of people has got it. It says, you're receiving this email because we're updating the YouTube terms of service and then right right below that it has terms in parentheses and quotations and I kid you not right there see it terms to clarify our terms and provide transparency to our users <coughs> excuse me the terms were similarly updated in the United States in November 2020 these changes shouldn't shouldn't significantly alter your access or use of the YouTube service a summary of the changes okay like uh, facial recognitions facial recognition restrictions the terms of service already state that you cannot collect any information that might identify a person without their permission while this has always included facial recognition information, the new terms make that explicitly clear. Now, YouTube's right to monetize, okay? YouTube has the right to monetize all content on the platform and ads may appear on videos from channels not in the YouTube Partner Program, okay? right there now I'm I'm YouTube partner so but this this could could affect me here royalty payments and tax withholding for creators entitled to revenue payments such payments will be treated as royalties from a US tax representative and Google will withhold taxes where required by law so they're not earnings anymore. They're, uh, they're royalties. Okay, but what's really bothering me the most is that YouTube, for channels like Monkey, for non-monetized channels, they're going to start running ads on them. They're going to be making money. The creator is not. They will not get a dime from the ads that they're putting on your videos. So I've watched a couple videos myself on this and one British guy or whatever the hell he was, he's he's all for it. He says, this, this could help you. And how can it help you? Well, he says, because if they're running ads on this certain video, then you know that's the content you're going to want to create. You don't need them running ads on your video to figure that out. All you got to do is look at the views. If you got a video with 600 views and then you got a video with six views, uh, duh. You know, he's not thinking about the fact that, that okay, as a creator, let's say you're a vlogger or you go, some, you go places like Monkey and I do, okay, it's your time. It's your vehicle wear and tear you're paying the gas for. You're filming. You are filming with the equipment that you bought and paid for out of your pocket. You are taking your time to edit these videos. Your time to upload these videos. And then YouTube swoops in, puts ads on your shit, give me 100% of the fucking money. Fuck you. That's stupid. Now they got a loophole here. Um, so, if you continue to use YouTube, the YouTube service, then you agree to them terms. You don't have to sign shit. 
All you got to do is just keep uploading videos and they take it as you agree that they're going to make money for all your hard work. And this guy didn't seem to have a problem with that. Well, I do. Um, so, I left a comment on his video because he said, give me a thumbs down, thumbs up, whatever, leave a nasty comment, I don't care. Okay, so I did. So I said, okay. I'm monetized. I'm a YouTube partner. I'm a small channel, but I'm a YouTube partner. I said, uh, you know, so you've got two channels. One's monetized and one isn't. The one that he was talking all this shit on isn't. I said, how about you come over, you do my filming with your equipment that you paid for, use your gas to come see me, you film my videos, you edit my videos on your time, you upload my videos on your time. I will sit back and collect the money. You don't get a penny. I probably won't hear back from him because that's a good point, isn't it? Do you go to work every day and, and, and let your boss make 100% of the profit and he don't give you anything? It's the same thing here. This is what it's turning into, a job. It's, it's not a social media platform anymore. It's all about them fucking making money. Not only that. The YouTubers that do make what little bit of money they have, unless you're Les Paul or some stupid asshole like that, who just gets on there and acts like a fucking stupid idiot as soon as he turns the camera on, he becomes retarded. Okay. Not only that, think about this. Okay. Um, this, this is going to hurt me as well. Because think about it. If they can run ads on a smaller channel's video at 100% profit okay they're going to start running less ads on my videos because why pay me when they're getting why pay me a percentage when they're getting a hundred percent from this channel so that's going to hurt me as well and people when they see a smaller channel they're not going to want to run sit through a 15 second ad out of a three minute video a forced 15 second ad they're not going to want to do that also, I mean, not to mention, they also took, you know, what was it, 15%? They give us a de decrease in, in our money? Really? I think it's bullshit. And I think people should have the balls to stand up to Google and YouTube because this is bullshit. Yeah, YouTube. They're afraid, oh, well, what are you going to do? Oh, well. No, it shouldn't be, oh, well. You're doing all the fucking work, all the legwork, your equipment, your fuel money, whatever. Your time out of your day to share a video with your friends and family. They're making money on that. You're not making a fucking dime. Think about that. Let that sink in. You know, this is ridiculous. A um, couple people commented and said, oh, you know, they're just hurting because of COVID because a lot of the the companies that that want to run ads didn't have the money to run ads so no they're not hurting come on google which owns youtube is not hurting <clears throat> billions of money billions of dollars a year they're not hurting you know what it's about this it's about this right here it's about greed how fat can i make this company's wallet get what some ceo must need to buy a new plane because this is probably six months old already so but sorry about that cut i had a wrong number come in and you know music because my ringtone but anyway so you know people are afraid of youtube well if i say something bad about youtube they'll they'll shut my channel down no they won't no they won't people do it all the time that's retaliation, which here in the United States, by the way, is illegal. You know, it's ridiculous. I mean, we're getting pennies, if that, and the small YouTubers are not getting a damn thing, and they're over there getting rich. They're sitting in their offices, probably not even in the office half the time. They're out playing golf. They're out on their yacht. They're they're living it up. They're living it up. Why? Why you you're the one out there, you know, doing the filming and doing the editing and and having uh, technical difficulties and all this just to throw up, 
you know, a 10 minute video that, that, that they're not even going to put out there to watch anyway because you ain't worth it to them. It's fucking bullshit. You know, because you're not Logan Paul because you're not, you know, crazy Russian hacker. Well, you ain't worth a shit. Fuck you. That's not what, you know, and he also said something about, you know, think about it. YouTube is just wants to make money. Really? And we don't? So that gives them the right to say, you guys go out and work your fucking ass off. We'll sit here and collect the money. That's bullshit, YouTube. That's bullshit. I mean, we need people. We need all of us to stand together. Why don't we just pick a day this year? One day. One day. Let's, let's you know, do our homework. Find out about what, what great day, you know, is good out of the year where people's uploading videos. Let's boycott them. Let's not. Nobody upload one just for one day that's all don't upload anything for one day you know let's get let's, let's get a bunch of us together and do that and then see how they fucking like it see how much money they lose while well, they're taking it from us why don't we take some from them but no nobody's got the balls to i'm just a little guy here you know four thousand subs which by the way remember they took over a thousand from me for some reason monkey was one of them <coughs> Now she can't even comment on anybody's videos. It's not just mine. It's anybody's. She can't. She comments. It shows up on hers. Nobody else's. I've been told it's the phone. It's. No it ain't. No it ain't. You know. It's just them picking on the little guy. That's all. You know. I've been told it's it's her channel name. Monkey1000. That could be because they're fucking stupid. That could be. I mean. W what the hell. You can't do anything anymore. This is ridiculous. We we just need to stand together and boycott them, quit being being pussies about this, and say, you know, we've had enough. You know, especially the smaller channels, the people that are doing the best they can. Oh, and another thing he said was because um, you know I pretty much wrote a paragraph about everything he said in my my opinion on it. He said and YouTube just just makes it great for for people just to come in and start making money really really well how come the video he's he's saying this on is on a channel that's not monetized as of yet um if it's that easy is it easy to get a thousand subscribers no i've been on here you know this is my 11th fucking year and i've only got four thousand subs really you know i've got 1200 videos you know two percent of my subscribers watch my channel what the fuck even happened for you know because you got to have a thousand subscribers and what is it four thousand hours of watch time hours of watch time in a year you fucking kidding yeah that's easy for a new youtuber to pick up a camera and just start making money now you pick up the camera they're gonna start making money you know monkey's been doing this for a couple years now she ain't making no money you know, come on, I've been, like I said, this is my 11th year. I'm good standings all across the board. I've only got 4,200 and some subscribers. I've got over 1,200 videos up. I'll tell you what I make. I make about $500 a month if I'm lucky. If I'm lucky. Why can't we boycott them? Let's share this video. Let's boycott YouTube for one fucking day. Just one day and see how shit changes. You know? I know not we can't get everybody to do it. Millions of people to do it. But geez, even if we got, you know, 10,000. 10,000 of us said, no, fuck it. We ain't uploading one day. Think about how much money they would lose. And then maybe they would start. Because see, all this, all this stuff is, you know, they make it sound all so cool. Changes YouTube's terms and service, you know. You're receiving this message. What the fuck, dude? this is all for them not us we're youtube let me tell you something youtube if if you work for youtube if you're a ceo or if youtube sees this which i doubt but if you do let me tell you this we're the motherfuckers making you money it's time you spread it around instead of stealing off the little guy because that's what you're doing that is what you're doing that's fucking bullshit that's greed it has nothing to do with oh we're hurting well we're hurting too you know, the little guys are hurting. You know, pinching pennies to put gas in your vehicle to try to make it to work. 
and then try to make it home and then try to eat something when you get home because you're hungry because you're working double shifts because why you're taking our fucking money too because that money should be going to us we should be getting at least 90 percent think about it we're doing everything everything what are you guys doing sitting back watching your bank account grow <laughs> there's another million cool all right let's go out <laughs> let's take another vacation i think they take a vacation from vacation and go to work for a week out of the year i think that's how that works with them bastards i think it's bullshit and here i'm trying to stand up for the small youtuber too the guy that's trying to get to where he can be monetized and be a youtube partner and can't because first of all, they don't put their videos out there. Now, second of all, what videos they do put out there for them, they're going to be making money on. You can't say a damn word about it. Bullshit. They didn't sign no papers. Monkey didn't sign any papers. And, and you can't just go, well, they must agree to it because they're still uploading. It don't mean you agree to shit. I want to, you know, sign a fucking paper. Let's get a class action lawsuit against them. Me included because, because the, they, they've stolen from me. They flat out stolen from me. They took a thousand subscribers from me. They're taking away. You know, I'm not getting my. I'm not getting my uh, comments. If I do, it's a couple weeks later, and people are getting pissed. Why? Don't, why didn't you get back with me? I asked you a question. Now you're getting back at me uh, because I just got it. You know, they're taking away views every day. Hundreds and hundreds of views just from me. Views. They're taking away them views. That means they took away the ads that ran on them videos that they kept the money for, but I don't get now because the view's not there, so I don't get the money. But they got the money as long as that video was up. As long as uh, the views were on there. You know, there's ads on there. They got the money, but if they take that view away, they're keeping the money from that view of them ads. That's bullshit. They're fucking thieves. Yeah, YouTube, you're fucking thieves. You know, God damn it, this is really the only way I can make a little extra money to help try try to make ends meet, you know, try to do my part, and you want to steal from me. I think we should boycott them, we should do a class action suit or something. You can't just go, well, you know, if you upload a video, you agreed that I can take, I can make money off of you and you can't do a damn thing about it. We're not giving you a dime. That's stupid. That's like saying, well, if you show up for work, you're agreeing that I'm not going to pay you today. It's no different. Is that legal? Hell no, not here in the United States. It's the same damn thing. If you show up for work today, you agree to the terms that I'm not going to pay you and I'm going to make 100% of profit of whatever you do for me. It's the same thing. Well, if you upload a video, then you're agreeing that I'm not going to pay you a dime for it, but I'm going to make money from you, from that video. That's illegal. That's illegal. How the fuck are they getting by with this? Because they're a big corporation. People say you can't fight the big corporation. If we get enough of us together, yes, we can. Class action suit. Let's boycott them. It don't cost a damn dime to just sit back and not, not upload a video for one day. I mean, that's not going to kill any of us. It's going to hurt them, though, if we get enough of us doing it. But anyway, that's enough for this rant today. It just, it just pisses me off, you know. Now they're picking on the people that ain't even a partner. You know, I'm a partner. They've been picking on me for a couple years now. Now they're picking on Monkey. She's never done any fucking thing wrong. They're going to want to make money on her videos that she works so fucking hard to do. You know? And she's not going to see a dime of it. To me, that's that's stealing from my fiancé. And I, I, I don't like someone thieving from my fiancé. That's fucking bullshit. Anyway, Shea Bear, the Myth of Man Legend, I'm gone for now. You know, let me know in the comments if you would be willing to do that. And we'll pick a day this year. Damn, let's hit them where it hurts. They're hitting us where it hurts. I'm gone for now. Bye-bye, guys. Have Enjoy the rest of your week.